What is up guys, here I have the brand new Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 4. This is one of the Samsung's new flippable phones, closable and you can open as well. And as you guys can see, I'm at the tab because I'm going to do a rough water test. I'm going to do two, but this is the first one. As you guys can see, the screen still works. The front and the screen right here will show you the time. But without further ado, let's go ahead and do the test. Right here, while well, the phone is on, get it all over the ports. Right here, the back of the phone, all over the cameras, over the speakers at the top, all over the screen, over the crease in the middle. Let's see. The C Flip 4. Let's see if this phone truly survives a rough water chest while the phone is folded, all over the camera at the top. Just like if you were to wash your phone or some dishes. Just like that. While the phone is closed as well. And yeah, now let's cut the water. And as you guys can see, the phone still works. But this was the easy water test. Let me unlock it. And the screen still works, as you guys can see. But this was the easy water test. Now we're gonna do a super rough water test and we're gonna dip it into deeper water. So this is the second part to the water chest video. I'm going to be dipping it for the, this is a Z Flip 4. I'm gonna dip it inside this tank right here and seeing if it survives. As you guys can see, the front screen works. It shows me the time and also the big screen works as well. So let's go ahead, without further ado, let's dip it inside the water. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it here while the phone is closed and I'm dipping it inside the water. As you can see, and I'm gonna take it all the way down. So now the phone is just resting right here right there and as you guys can see if I'm not mistaken there's some air bubbles coming out of the phone if I'm not mistaken so I hope the phone does not break and it should be about one meter in if I'm not mistaken maybe more but it is a couple inches in so I'm gonna go ahead and take out the phone as you guys can see and I'm gonna open it up and I'm gonna do the same thing all the holes are filled up with water. The screen still works, but now let's see if it breaks while it's still in the water. Let's see. There you go. And that is a Z Flip 4. And guys, remember not to do this at home. This one has an IPX8 water rating, so it should be certified to do this test. This this test, so it should be good. But do not try this at home. Your phone could break or it could come with some malfunctions. So keep in mind not to do that. But yeah, now I'm going to go ahead and take out the phone. As you can see, I left it half folded, so maybe some water got inside on the back. But yeah, let's turn it on. And boom. Samsung always comes up with the best water ratings, and the phone did not break. Now, we just got to wait for the speakers to dry up, and then the phone will be back to 100% working condition. Let's see the screen. As you can see, yep, the screen still works. Perfectly fine. Let's see the front screen. The front screen for it works perfectly fine as well, showing me my time and the date and my battery. But yeah, this phone is really good. Remember, IPX at water rating. Make sure you guys subscribe. If this phone breaks, I'll leave a comment down below, a pinned comment saying that the phone broke after like 20 minutes of it uh, being out of the water. If there's no comment down there, then the phone survived and the phone is still doing very, very good. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.